Hello viewers, welcome, good morning, good afternoon, and good evening. Welcome to JMTVGH, your number one African history TV station. Uh, wherever you're watching me today, we are here once again to ask our father, our grandfather, the man who knows more history about Africans, to tell us more about the history and what he know about uh, maybe Gold Coast, maybe Avery Coast, maybe uh, all of that, what you need to know, uh, we are here to ask him so that he can tell us more. So wherever you are watching me, you just go to YouTube, search for JMTVGH and subscribe to the channel and share the program. Every comment you have, you just bring it. And the baby be our Sambia will share me now. I have JMTVGH. But what they are saying, you may be uh, 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 follow now for what you may share program no JMTVGH our Facebook and our YouTube so so uh, JMTVGH subscribe now share program no ye papa ya deni na ye nana I want him be brave far a be before uh, ye abako se mono ya sabi pi one in chain and no pay se on chay more a fahon se ne wea minu mienu ya hinta ye ya ayira ye no ye betu mi enhu a chile coin ya tano vinya pao official female me le fufla ya my door is on me, the JMTVGHG. Mi Jabba, the program ya, Mia Togbe, Mia To, Mia Fun Shang, because ye young cho a vow, but a may bow for a Nyajo Jong, few came cho, a few ballad you call my bar, a young gay do chong, the fish a fila, Jabba Baba, like the Facebook, a lo YouTube, like the YouTube by JMTVGHR, and Jabba Baba, I subscribe a TV Alfama. I feel Jabba Babe, Yame, now my bubble, and no hono pobble over vi, fee you with me cho, I feel ballet the papa, eata, a fisher fee killer, Magaya Fireco, a mighty de breco, conemo vacqua, mighty de togbo, and Tim Mummy Trammy Hussima, Namiba, a Macotto Binch, and Nafi, Jumediano, a dear chasse, a beano brothel, eh, we are going to do it in English, so you don't worry, everything we are speaking, whether airway, tree, or it will come to English so that you understand. Uh, I'm going to commercial break shortly. Yeah, welcome to JM TVGH once again. This is your host, JM. Here with me, Osofo Kofiche Ahaji. And to talk to you, I'm going to talk to you. I'm going to talk to you. Story of your name, and I'm going to talk to you. 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 I'm going to talk to Tamanyo do be fiaka cho le sro mi agbobo kemi biye be no enya ngo tayanto no je gomo kwa ano ine te fere hia be mi abia question le mano wa mi abia question me ikebe uha aten semanyo le ta magaya fireko lo programaro na na kualike o koko ira ta mi aje gomo cho fe gbama ye be shasi e fry be wa se because e va we mi nya ta je be ma je gomo cho fe gbama tobi Bwezo. Mazonre ungu. Mwere kukun waka. Mwere kukun waka. Agwaja. Agwaja, ok. Togbi mwere kwa agwaja. Akba. Aha. Ekba haminga dowe zona ufa JMTVG. Yo. Nia ma dowe zona ni. Mwere kukun afa mwere de vyo fode. Mashia ma fon. Akba. Ekba haminga dowe zona ufa JMTVG. Yo. How we start last time. Uh, people are interested with the story. People That's give it. comment. Oh, this man, we know that he know a lot of, uh, he know a lot. Uh, how do you say it? Uh, he know history about mm -hmm. Africa, so we want to hear more from him. So you have to try and go there and interview him. So today we are here again to ask you, uh, whatever you know. The last time you told us about uh, tonal language speaking yeah. people, where we can find them. Yes. So today we want to know more about them, uh, where we, uh, they are coming from, where they base right now, and people who identify that tonal language. Uh, one man uh, called 
uh, how do you call it? Good. Herodotus. Uh, that man was learning and find out that no, the tonal language speaking people are the people who live in the place that time. But yeah. as uh, on his time or as on the time he was learning, he didn't find those people there. So he's wondering where to find those people. So we want to know more about how those things came about before the man couldn't find them that where time. they were. Thank you. Mm -hmm. uh, okay. May you know, said that Toshishia to all your miller, Baba of Wow. Okay. Okay, Joe, as you owe your loan of all. She got a wee John Amo Jonala, own of all in a chimelio. Okay. A foot off for the Nama. A new mamma lolo had the Amoka town. You know, I am not a waffle of you. Okay. What I'm implying is that uh, the other time when we were discussing this issue, mm. the tonal language speakers were those who lived along the southern, which the Greeks decided to name the Nile. Mm. Okay. And they lived on a land known variously as Ta Shi. Okay. Mm? Mm. The lake. Yeah. Then uh, we had Kama, mm -hmm. the sandy place. Yeah. In fact, uh, the most popular name remained Kama. Mm -hmm. And the people were known as Kemetians, according to the English. Okay. But what happened before they left it there? Good. There is a part of their settlement called Nubia. Mm -hmm. Nubia, Nubia simply means envy, envy or jealousy. Yeah. And jealousy from whom? From those who could not understand what the, how these people were gifted to make all those wonderful things. Mm -hmm. Now we had a situation where the Icarus brothers were supposed to be the people who waxed feathers to their arms and launched the world into the aviation age. Okay. Which the Americans also claim the Wright brothers. In fact, this year they will, they will be celebrating the aviation age again because America is uh, virtually the most powerful. Mm -hmm. So yeah. they have admitted their version of the story to be the truth. Mm -hmm. So the World Aviation Day is celebrated as uh, what was instituted by the Americans. Okay. But then they also claimed, like I said the other time, that they waxed feathers to their arms and launched the world. Mm -hmm. And I showed you that before they could wax feathers to their arms, the symbol of Maat, mm -hmm. justice, uh, truth, and fair play, mm -hmm. was something which the ancient occupants of Kama had long exhibited. Mm -hmm. So if they have exhibited this one, and we followed it with uh, the winged bar, the winged soul mm -hmm. of a dead person who was being mummified. Okay. So you see that that winged bar had a head, human head with human face, but it is a bed. Yeah. And it was flying over the body mm -hmm. of the person who was being mummified. Yeah. So, yeah. so this is what... Yes, so you have it there. Yeah. Then you have the bed flying over the... This one. The body. Okay. Then, from that one, they developed the so glider, the this plane. The this is the first one, the bed, and the second one. I hope last time we show it. Yeah. So, yeah, so, let's continue. With that one, mm -hmm. it meant that all the claims by the Greeks and uh, the Americans is not true. Okay. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Because it has been done. So that is why the Europeans and Americans and all these Western uh, white people have found it difficult to accept that 
black people were those who lived in the Keme Valley. Mm. So all their names have to be changed. Their language had to be changed. In fact, now they are claiming that the original language of the area is Coptic as they are found. <laughs> but Coptos mm -hmm. is a settlement named by the Greeks of a place. Okay. So Coptic becomes the name of the language allegedly spoken in that settlement, mm -hmm. which is not an indigenous language. The settlement too is not indigenous. If you look at the names of the various places, you see that the Greeks have changed most of the names. Okay. Even the name of the whole area which we are calling Egypt today was not Egypt. So what's the name? Hmm? That's Kerma. Okay. Egypt is the name of a Greek supposed to say that Egyptos, the people have dark skin color. Mm. So that's how they came by that name. And once they have changed the name of the place, they went ahead and changed so many other things and adulterated even changing the truth. The story of the Bible mm -hmm. was supposed to have been composed by the Hebrews, okay. transcribed from the Hebrew Torah mm -hmm. by so-called Jews yes. who were supposed to be intellectuals. Mm -hmm. So they went into the Hebrew Torah as the insistence of uh, Ptolemy the second Philadelphus, a Greek man. Mm -hmm. Who follow, whose father followed uh, Alexander the Great okay. to conquer the land we knew as Keme, but okay. which they changed to be e Egypt. E Egypt, okay. But when Alexander the Great set foot on the land, the first thing he did was to go westwards okay. to a place where there was an oasis and an oracle was there to go and find out. Mm -hmm. And at that place, he said he was made the king. Okay. He was, uh, the oracle said he will be a great man. He will rule over the whole world. So which was the world? The world became the universal concept known as Catholicism. Okay. So he went around defeating people until he finally died. But when he left Keme mm -hmm. or Egypt, mm -hmm. he left one of his generals, Ptolemy, to be the one in charge. Okay. And Ptolemy, he, he ruled the second Ptolemy. Mm -hmm. What did he do? He said, these people living in these places with their temples and their, mm -hmm. their temples and their belief system, mm -hmm. they are so powerful. So we will have to change and take over their concept of belief. Okay. And that concept brought about what you know today as the Bible. Okay, so that concept as the one you know today as the Bible. Uh, le let me go to commercial break shortly. Yeah, welcome back. As Togbia Haji was saying, and he was talking about the concept about the Bible. Because now I wanted to ask that question before he entered there. So, okay. Togbia Haji, continue for me. Yes, mm -hmm. uh, what became known as the Bible mm -hmm. was occasioned by Ptolemy Philadelphus II calling upon people to transcribe what they claim it was the Hebrew Torah. Okay. The Hebrew sacred teachings of the Creator. Mm -hmm. But then you ask yourself, where were the Hebrews at that time? Okay. Hmm? The Hebrew or the Hebrews. So they, they call them Hebrew. Hebrew. Meaning of Hebrew. Hmm? You see that uh, 
if you look at the crown of the pharaohs of Egypt, yes. you will have the head of a cobra or snake yes. on one side. Mm -hmm. Then the other one is the head of the vulture. Okay. Have you heard the vulture making so much noise before? No. Yes. Vulture will not make so much noise unless it spots some caca somewhere. Yes. And it will make a shrill noise. Okay. Her blue. Uh, her blue. Yeah. So even if the hot vulture is aquapim, is at aquapim, yeah. and there is a carcass at a Collegono, mm. and the vulture picks, it has extra sensitive For smelling okay. taste. Okay. So when the thing is dead somewhere far even, and it, it picks it up, it will follow that scent and get to the place. Okay. Having read the place, it will make a shrill sound. All vultures in the vicinity, uh, wherever, mm -hmm. they will hear that sleep sound and follow and come. Okay. And help the vulture to clear the carcass. Mm. So the vulture is the best environmental bird. Yes. So at that time, they said no one has any right to kill, to kill. a vulture. Yes. Up till today, that regulation is still in force. Mm, but this country, they are, they are killing it. Yes. Anyhow. And now, once they are killing the vultures, and they have cut down the trees on which vultures Now our stays. system is everywhere. Now, bola. you see, everywhere Dirty there is... Bola. Dirty, dirty. So? The animal who re die you on remove, the street. You remove the environmental cleaning officer. And that's and you what want you have. To clean your environment. You want to clean the environment, and the environment <laughs> is a stinking hell. Oh right? my God! Yeah. So they give a place of honor to the vulture because the vulture does so not they make. They call noise. that place her blue. Her blue. Who, the, who, who the, today they call Hebrews. Hebrews. <laughs> hmm? Okay. Now the Hebrews are supposed to have been. The chosen ones of the creator of the universe. Okay. Then we were lied to that uh, the chosen one, the creator of the universe chose them and asked some guy called Moses mm -hmm. to lead them out of Egypt. the land of Egypt. Wow. Because a, a Pharaoh was too wicked. Mm -hmm. But this was the same Pharaoh who invited them in and gave them food. Yes. And when you read the story of Joseph, mm -hmm. when the brothers sold him into slavery and he was brought to Egypt, mm -hmm. they gave them they gave him a Good. position. Yes. And when his brothers came looking for food to it, they get they, they got them. it. Yes. If the Pharaoh was so wicked. Why did he receive them with both arms, gave them all that they needed? Okay, so before you continue, there's this story circulation mm. that our ancestors ruled the story on the stone. So when the white people came, they took all those stones and they now turn into the Bible story as we are reading today. I want to find and out if there's something like that. That is, is what in the I'm system. telling you that mm. they have written what they wrote was written on this paper created out of this yes. plant. Mm. So they wrote the scrolls. Okay. But after the Greeks had caused the 70 so-called Jews, Jewish intellectuals to transcribe what the Hebrews have written. If you want to find out the falsity of their story, they tell you that the Jews Jewish intellectuals were taken into the great library of Alexandria mm -hmm. and they were 70. So they said that the Septuagint. Septuagint represents 70 people. Okay. And uh, they went in. Mm -hmm. They went in. They were kept in separate cubicles. Okay. But they never told us that the people had some documents they were copying. Mm -hmm. But on this on this one, okay. This is supposed to be the 
Septuagint manuscripts. Okay. Mm? Mm -hmm. If you had such a manuscript, how can you compose a story out of this torn thing? Mm. But the Bible had been composed out of it. Wow. Mm? So let, let, let me say it. This is how it is. Hope if you can see it. Well. That is part well. of the. So that is part of the book or yes. the, the, this thing. It has the whole thing here. And the Bible tells which came out of uh, this Septuagint thing. Mm -hmm. It's contained almost all the portions of the Bible. It's here. Then, yes. Okay. Then when you come, when they were in, uh, when the Septuagint were in Alexandria, mm -hmm. in the library of Alexandria, transcribing the Hebrew Torah, mm -hmm. we have been told in their own recordings that the Septuagint didn't have any document to use, but then the, the God or the Hebrew God came to all the cubicles and gave them the same idea to, to write, the write. Bible, yeah. and they wrote that one. Yes. But when you come to the Osirinkus papyri, mm -hmm. it tells you that there are a group of uh, manuscripts discovered during mm -hmm. the late 19th and early 20th centuries by archaeologists including mm -hmm. so so and so then at an ancient rubbish dump near oxyrhynchus wow so there were documents which were supposedly to, given to, to the them, septuagint to root the bible and then they com composed that one but when you go and take all texts of the bible mm -hmm. every 10 years you study it, you see Different that things. they are making changes. Yes. Why? Because they concocted a whole lot of stories and they didn't know the truth. So when they talk today that people cross the Red Sea, the Red Sea was parted for them to walk across it. Tomorrow they will tell you that they came from Goshen. Goshen which is at the delta of the Nile mm -hmm. and they walked because today Everybody knows that at the time they were supposed to have crossed the Red Sea, there was land route. Yes. And where they were staying, maps have been drawn showing that the people the actually walked, walked across, across the, the land. land. Not the water. And Sinai the water. today, Sinai mm -hmm. Peninsula is still part of Egypt. Huh. So if you say the wickedness of the Pharaoh they caused you Egypt. to leave and cross the sea, and now we know that no, it is not. It is, it's so still you have part to of continue Egypt. changing the story. Mm. Even the last time I heard that uh, the Pope want them to change another story in the Bible. They have to change it because, because the they are talking about Egypt. Out. But now the Americans are ruling the world, so they can't put Egypt, Egypt. or uh, Israel so, there and told them that they are the one who ruled the world. You see, Alexandria is up. The rest, uh, the Mediterranean coast. Mm -hmm. But this Osirinkus papyrus was found 160 kilometers down of the Southern River. Wow. Where they found the Dung Hill. Mm -hmm. When people sat on the coast mm -hmm. and found the, and transcribed the Hebrew Torah, mm -hmm. people, the British people came 160 kilometers south and found the manuscripts thrown on a dunghill. Wow. So it means that what you, you earlier claimed is not true. Mm -hmm. There was something written. Mm -hmm. And that thing written, how did it come about that the thing flew from the coast of the Mediterranean and came inland? Mm. It's not possible. Somebody carried it, yes. and it could not be on a downhill, mm -hmm. and the, the transcription could not have happened at the place uh, Alexandria, as you claim, mm -hmm. because there was only, and there is only one Alexandria, okay, where there is a library. So when you come once this day, how come that they threw these things on a downhill, far down? and not at the original place. Uh -huh. If I am throwing some paper out here, maybe I have a, 
a dustbin there. Yeah. I will put you the paper put inside. inside. Yeah. I will not carry the paper and travel for miles to my village. And go and, and, uh, go throw, and it throw it on a dung hill. Then some people will come and discover the same thing I said. Well, it never existed. So instead of them to tell us the truth, they are now telling us they throw out away the Bible or the, the book. No, they, they, they said there was no Ooh, book, book for them for, to look at. Oh, that okay. it was God who brought the idea into their head and they mm -hmm. all did the same similar thing. Mm -hmm. Then later on, somebody comes and says, oh, what you used to come up with the Septuagint manuscript, mm -hmm. which resulted in the Greek Orthodox Bible, mm -hmm. whose papyrus has exposed them, mm -hmm. that there was something written. And on the basis of what these British people found, in Aussie wrinkles, mm. and they took back to Britain. Then Britain now claims that uh, they have the, the, original. the Bible, okay. and they called it uh, King James Version. version. Mm. Then you ask yourself, King James Version of what? <laughs> it means because there was if, something there. If you don't have something yes. before, you can't have no a version have of it. Good. Okay. So King James version of the Bible was telling you that the Septuagint who are, came up first with the so-called Greek Orthodox Bible mm. didn't do complete work. Mm. Now studying you will come to realize that what has been presented to us okay. is not correct. Yes, yes. If it is not correct, why did, is it not correct? It is not correct because the message the in owner. there is different from the message the which has been given. Okay. And you can see from this that the thing is torn. Mm. So you just pick it and coin something there and think just, that it will that, fit. Okay. And you look at all the papyri scrolls over a period of time, the truth is not complete. Okay. They are all broken into bits. And the uh, Aussie Wrinkles Papyri is telling you that the things were kept in a dung hill. <laughs> now, how did they come to arrange all the no, passages this, this in the in Bible? Bible. Okay. Because you go to Russia today, mm -hmm. St. Peter's uh, Basilica in Russia, yeah. they also have the Septuagint manuscript. Wow. All over the world, they say they have kept them somewhere, like you have the Osirinkus papyri mm -hmm. are currently housed in many institutions all over the world. Wow. If the thing was found in Egypt and it was Ooh, taken it to Britain, it is, right? how come it is all over the world? Mm -hmm. Because what you are telling us is not, not the truth. truth. If it is not the truth, then some people owe the truth. And where can we find the Those truth? people, yes. Those people who own the truth, mm -hmm. that is why we are not being told who the tonal language speaking mm -hmm. people are. Mm. The tonal language people, like Herodotus said, possess the powers of divination to interpret the will of the Creator. Okay, so now the question is, that Herodotus man, yes. after he find out uh, the tonal language speaking people, does he proclaim it or telling people no, well, this is the original, he, or he keeps it. He state the attributes of those tonal language speaking people. Okay. They have thick lips, they have a broad nose, they okay, have big so eyes, they he have fine eyes. He they described them how they are. Okay. And uh, that description was not limited to him, mm -hmm. because when you look at this man, hmm, okay. this man okay. is a black man. Yes. This man, the Sphinx, is a black. Is black. The so, people so who this, made this okay, the first sphinx. man, and then this one, the Dulagba. Those who made such things, mm -hmm. they are not gone. Mm -hmm. They might have left because I told you that uh, people leave their locations either mm -hmm. because there is lack of water, yes, because uh, the, the land is, is small for them, small for them, mm -hmm. or enemy attacks yeah so enemy attacks they have to leave okay and when they leave they must find a place to settle okay and how do they settle 
they had to do some spiritual investigations as to whether that place is ideal for them to stay. Okay. And that is where you have the Afa divination. And then when they do the Afa divination and they find out that the deity or the spirits of the place are receptive to their coming, then they settle. You will settle, you will be there, you will be doing everything, the water will be coming, you will have everything. Mm -hmm. If another event develops, mm -hmm. enemy attack or something, then you have to move. Mm -hmm. And this is how, how it has come about that so, our so people have they moved. were going, if they settle in some place and they hear that the, that the enemies are coming, they have to left and go if, to another if place. You, if you come to this place to settle and you realize that first the land is not good for your agricultural purposes, mm -hmm. you have to go. You that is one reason. Okay. Another reason is that the water is not adequate to cater for all of you. Okay. The third reason is that your population is expanding. Mm -hmm. And the land is too small for Too you. small. So you see some of them will leave, some will mm -hmm. remain. Okay. Then if there is enemy attack here and there too, they will still continue. Okay. They will go and create new settlements, continue creating until they have a the place. place. By where we have reached, they have moved and moved and moved and there is no place again because all other people have moved. The population of the earth or the uh, environment, increasing. it has over increased. Okay. Who are you going to drive away from his place? No. Like uh, that uh, politician said the other time that the uh, airways, uh, airways, airways are, are not, not Ghanaians. Ghanaians. So they should go to where they are coming yes, from. Yes, so where are they going? <laughs> so let me find out this thing. Mm -hmm. The time our ancestors are coming to where they are yes. right now, is there a different, different language or is the only the tonal language? They started with the tonal language. Okay. But when you move and uh, the principal group has left you, mm -hmm. the environment will compel you to adapt. Okay. Because it is not an empty world. Because of the wherever energy Wherever you they reach, use. Okay. wherever you reach, mm -hmm. you will meet some people there. Like you start now, when you go up into the Volta region, mm. from the coast, you will see they speaking Angla. Yes. Then you will get to be having variations of the Anglo mm -hmm. language yes. till you get, you get to, to Tong, then you get to Vodoma. Different, uh, different the, la the language is, uh, the tonation is changing. Yes. Everybody is speaking his aspect of it. Okay. The same thing when you cross. So if we look at the variations of the language, mm -hmm. you see that the written one we have accepted today, mm -hmm. as, as far as the tonal language speaking it's, people are concerned, yeah. is the Aglon version. Yes. But when you move into Togo, you will see that the tonation it's, is it's different. different. Far, when far, you far, move far. from Togo and you enter it's into Benin, Benin it's you will see that it's different. But you, you can, if you, you are you, every you, man, you can hear yeah. what then they are saying. When you move into Nigeria, it's different. It's different. You enter into Badagri. You go in and you go to read the confluence of the Niger. Mm -hmm. You get the thief speaking people. Okay. And except for some single words or phrases that they will use for you to understand that these people are speaking your language. Mm. The majority of what they say is different. Mm. Then you have the Yorubo speaking people in Nigeria. Okay. They, what makes one identify them as belonging to the tonal language speaking culture is the cloth the men normally wear around their waist and they go around their normal duties. Okay. And then one unifying factor too is the use of divination. Mm -hmm. You have divination running through some of the tonal language speaking, speaking people, people right up into Abyssinia. Okay. You go into the temples of Lalibela and you will see that like in the Christian Bible they take they tell you that Jesus went into the temple and drove away those who were changing money. And yes. What were they doing in the temple? They are using divination. 
They use divination to find out. If you go and complain <laughs> about your problem, your yes. business is not going yes. well, the diviner will divine So you for give you. something small before yes. they will do the divination for you. You have to do that one. And if you don't have money to buy the animal... You use animal in those things. They have to make the sacrifices. They have to perform the rituals for you. If it is the black man performing a ritual, you say that that is satanic. Mm. Yeah. But if it is a white man, he's performing oh, that something one that is, is holy. Good. Okay, so, so today, can we say in authority that, like you said earlier, uh, the language is one. They started with one language, but along the line, how yes. they are you see, going they told you that, different, uh, different way. You uh, see, they have lied in the Bible that uh, they, they, read, uh, they were building a tower yes, to go yes, and read yes. God and God Even God yesterday angry. I was asking my photographer that, ah, that, that only this thing, I'm, I'm yes, always uh, thinking about uh, it, God I don't understand. God decided to scatter the tower uh, and, and they, change their language. Yes. Then you ask yourself, today, the same people are building skyscrapers, <laughs> they are sending spaceships into outer space. Yesterday I was discussing that thing. Than, uh, the tower they were supposedly building. Wow. Why hasn't this God got angry? And changed or destroyed so, this thing? They came and they attacked our settlements, enslaving people. Mm -hmm. We had uh, two types of slavery. Yes. You know? Mm -hmm. The Atlantic slave raid, mm -hmm. then the Trans Saharan slave raid. Wow. Mm -hmm. In the Trans-Sahara which took place in East Africa, okay. you see that the young ones, especially the males, yes. are castrated. They will cut the male reproductive organ, mm -hmm. they will cut it halfway. By the time it heals, you can't have any child when you are grown. Mm. And they so that the they will not have more blacks there. They will not, you, black population cannot increase. Mm. They have to remove the black population. Just like uh, I was reading on one of the social media platforms mm. that Bill Gates said the potency of the corona they're bringing out is going to be 10 times more terrible than what we have seen. Because mm -hmm. they want to eliminate it the black blacks. population. Because the black Africa is where we have all the mineral deposits. Okay, so today can we say that because of the new, that one day the blacks will take over everything or they will hit back. If That's the were, reason why they are doing all those If you are in their shoes, things. what will you do? Mm. That you have stolen somebody's property and the person is getting wise. If he gets wise, he will come and say, oh, my friend, bring me my thing. So what do you do? You have to eliminate him. You have to create a social order which will make him subservient to you every time. Mm. You created an educational system which makes sure that the black man does not reason again. Mm. The black man always looks up to the white man. We are talking the white man's language. I mean, it's true. If you wanted to go to, to your school, language, your you distance. are going to school, Yes, what you don't speak you your want, language. Don't speak uh, vernacular. If you speak vernacular, we will sack you from the school. Yes, so that is what they have uh, ensured that we have. That is what they have ensured we have. This is your number one online television, JMTVGH, the African promotion. That's our purpose. We wanted to promote Africa. And the person promote Africa and our cabra Yen ni anumu B N T. Anka de we de anka yebe yen wa ayibe nkuwa. There is no ayibe. Ewe. Anka yebe yen wa ewe nkuwa. He. Tugbe de. Onim adeni ni nanti. Enu no kanu. There is no ayibe. So from today going, if you want to say ayibe or call me ayibe ma, I will not respond. But ewe. The name is ewe. That's what we are trying to do. And I say ye pe say ye. But. Uh, senior nyama koyenti nkakra nkakra na ebe sesa e dia koy main language ah ye nka um kasa because wo hwe books na ekita me na secret bi wo mu a wo boso a on hwe ya man no ye ba betam no dia ko enu nti e na ye pese ni kakra kakra nyame boa so wo boa na me boa ye betumi aka no ye kasa me na aka ho nta no vinye pegbeto 
enya de de ka no shi nyima no gbogbo bo e wa o ne mi le nwo ma mi me pa na de mi anu ni ohun vo po nya ike to gbogbo da me nya do bedo ko choko ba po book de kale internet o lo ya nto yi de fuma o nko mo ko yoyo rivernal e pe to 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 ma o a ya nto yi de te fuma o va po won bo a o especially nya va po bo a o ale ngo le le fuma fuma to gbogbo le fuma yo ko ko nglo de book ma e pe Tano zuba na no linen ma mia vao je ba mia pere talkbing la na mia fa platform gaga gaga talkbing ma nyaba vote afia TV station pe radio station bogboli gafu fwa mo je ba mia na time ma talkbing bari no chunya yao dada vao ba susume afi choma na talkbing ova yua mia ha mia tenya na na ta je ba mia jaba ba mia pere mia no no ne mo kata na iji ta jaba ba Facebook YouTube JMTVGH Jagbaban ya share program alfu mokata na mabubo he share na me ya ogbona na mabubo bo hawa watun senya goma ne mi anya ameyo kenya pao ntimisra ye nyina ye bomodi se ye betumi asum na story and asa bakose mi wasi kasa no mudi share say from baku ba se ye kona we amania fa ha we amania fa hanu na koyi ni sa enu ntim muma misima en twa me ho embra na me ba de aka no togbi edi beto so amaye Yo ado fami sa mama ko be biom aha ye JMTVGH senior medical kanu ye wo sofo ko fiche aha jinchen ye bisa na bakosem enu ti ya tuni did the journey into every language in Africa as a whole the journey into every history every history um fanche me the journey into every history in Africa as a whole nti e pese ye hu eh uh, hwamu no ye tuna speaking language people no eh e bi before say e bi before him fa for him fa no mo se sia enu na eh na watwe a etwe mu no be mi enu na ye ni ni start no o chiriche bebe na mu enne so nsem o yi pepe no pokoro no mi hu adwere mi nti egu so wo ne ho aye pese ko ne ho na de ka no ye di wie ye ye wo brofo mu mu fa nche ye na nka sa nyama we na na nka pese ye wo brofo ye be ye no twi nko ba sa na e wo se ye ko no nka kan kra emre bi be ba ye be ye no ye kasa mu kwa se ne be ye anu mu so let me go to him and then we will continue from there. Uh, uh, Togwi, yeah, me, me, I Fuma. Okay, mm. uh, if you look at this papyrus, mm -hmm. this is Matthew chapter one in the, the, the New the, Testament. Yeah. Yes, this is where it is taken from. If you have all these gaps which are missing. How do you come with the correct story you claim constitutes Matthew chapter 1? Mm. So this, this is the original book that they took? Then you have to, this is the papyrus they brought together. But because of its old paper, so some of them... They claim lost it is lost. Okay. But what they transcribed, will it be the correct thing? No. No. And they said, uh, and Jesus said, and Petro said, mm -hmm. and this one said, you were not there when the thing was happening. How can you write a story about it? And who was Matthew? Matthew is a British name. Yes. Was Matthew a Jew or a Hebrew? Or even the tonal language speaking no, person? The, uh, none that of them cry. was. <laughs> hmm? Okay. So all the New Testament people, Are British. they didn't even do no anything. anything. They about knew this next thing. to nothing about it. But then, they have been presented as those who gave us the New Testament. Mm. And we had uh, this man, Constantine. Yes. He was the emperor of the East Roman Empire. Yes. He was based in uh, Istanbul. Mm -hmm. At the time, they called Istanbul Constantinople. Yes. And Constantinople, Istanbul, is part of the Arab kingdom. Okay. And the Arabs were those who brutalized the black people a lot. 
they did all the harm to us. They came into Egypt, the, or the southern river valley, and took all our things away. How come we have uh, a car? Then they mm. say they have a ka Kaaba. Come, yes. Then the so-called Israelis also talk of Kabbalah. Yes. But what have they done to the original? So, uh, talk me this macho this thing will continue in terms okay. of Constantine issue. It, it, it is not only this. Okay. Constantine organized a conference mm -hmm. in Turkey at a place called Nicaea. Mm -hmm. And uh, they came up with so-called Nicene Conference. Mm -hmm. Nicene Creed in the Roman Catholic Church. Okay. Now you look at the Bible, the New Testament, and you have some crazy mm -hmm. names like Philippians, Colossians, yes. Thessalonians, mm -hmm. and all. Paul's letter to them. Yes. Who was Paul? The name Paul is an English name. Okay. Was Paul there? Let's, let's, let's end it in that topic. Who mm -hmm. was Paul? And why all about these names in that book or in this our tonal language today they have changed everything so next time we'll continue from there senior talk with canon why in the airport no no cross at time no oh they're no nim fan who and all the better bible my uh i'm a kenya poly and no but paul i'm a kenya poly i love my that time i feel woman i feel book more cut away your ballot book on the philippians the solenic calculator to talk to a okata Next time, I'm going to go to the house. I'm going to go to the house. And I'm going to go to the house. I'm going to go to the house. And I'm going to go to the house. 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 I'm going to go to kwa shase from first one so sa obenya ntiasie ebedo eh bibia ye wosese wan humi bi mu ana wan timi ka bi ma mu nya be ma jem ni makram nyina bye bye Yo, I do for your friend me James Mauko, I do donate for me JM. What you know? Now what be saw him? Sadden thing I do donate case. Ye na na no mo de. Oma tu su nyamia se o sumna o be ko hell ana se o be ko biya o be bre. Ne bi no mo de. Oma tu su nyamia se o sumna o be ko biya o hu beto ana se heaven. What be saw him say? Sadden thing I ban sa. Ne chire ansa na wana omu tusu bakone de ombe kachire se de ye na na no mu kremu no omu ntuntwene na omu de ne de omu nji wa bisa sa asem no ho wenti ene edi jumede aya tu ne de african spirituality se de brew owo jm tvg h so na yetumi abe mpenifo ahinfofo konfo eni busunso fo na ye jitum se omu ene omu kra ye na na no mamamre mu ase osun sa mamre na obekobo nsamjem ene binu mu susu de o ma pawo sese o mbe sum nyame a o mu wa o mbe ko heaven ye bebe sampenifo no na ye bisa o mu se e ba ne sen ene ye nana no mu de o ma mfa de o sum na o be ko heaven ne bo ma ko fa de o sum na o be ko hell na de am sampenifo ye wo ne nyina no o ma tumi aka kye mini omie no na ye ho se okay we na se sum na ye be nya hoto we na se sum no susu a ye nya hoto na tumi abo mini omie no ama ya bra bo atumi asiye ye ntimi srew se boa na dwomede ntumi do afofro do do na nche na yetumi asua dia ye nananom edi gaye se no ene ye papa ana se enye no ene ye papa nti bomode aso be ko facebook na ko follow ye facebook page no e jm tv gh u tapi jm tv na tintam na tapi gh enu ne be ba follow page no na fi program se bia wo ho bia no bomode aso be se share sa so so na ko youtube Ube sechi JM TV GH. U type JM na tintem na type TV no na tintem na type GH no. Ube hunse enu ne di edi kanya ebeba. Bomo dia se ube subscribe. Chwen kakra adoma ni beba miyaso u miyaso a. Emri biya yedi video betu muno. On sabe ka na fi otu miyashe ama fufra nyebi. Di eka ni se African spirituality e dien ene umu. Ena dien ena yena nanumu edi jaye. Bomo dia se ube boa ema programi. 
etumi adofu frapinche na yenso ya tumia suya adipa ina nanumudijaye edamuase.